Celebrity Dish from your friend Rob Shooter from the Naughty But Nice podcast. Scandal and vice, or sugar and spice, it's naughty but nice with Rob. Selena Gomez says speculation about her life got so out of control, it was actually killing her. That's right. So Selena is explaining that her time in the limelight is actually something that was really, really bad for her, and that's why she's getting so candid about everything in her life. Sources tell me exclusively, I hit the phones to all my best Selena sources and they told me they are very concerned about what she's doing. So slamming the media, blaming the media, while actually doing this on the cover of a magazine might not be the best approach. Some people are even saying it's a little hypocritical. You can't really slam the media in a media interview. They make a good point. So I used to be a publicist, you know that. So I know what I'm talking about with celebrities and the press. It's very tricky. It is very tricky uh, being a big celebrity because you want to be relevant. You want to sell music. You want to sell movies. Your fans really want to get to know you and like you. And the way that you do that is by doing press. Selena did an interview with Amy Schumer. I didn't know these two were that close, but they are. And she told Amy that she decided to be increasingly open about her personal life once things got out of control and she felt the need to take ownership of her own narrative. She said, quote, my intentions were never to become a tabloid. So when things kind of happened that way, it got out of control. And then I was like, wait, none of this is true. Selena added that the media often made things sound really bad when in fact nothing was bad. She fell in love, she went away for a while, nothing was bad. So she started to open up and take control of her narrative because once again she said it was killing me. No one has the right to tell me how my life is going. Amy asked her, should we be worried for you? Selena replied, no. I guess what I mean is that people worry about me because I've had some troubles in the past. That's true, but I'm okay. If I'm having a tough week or I'm not up to doing something, I don't do it. So she doesn't do stuff she doesn't want to do anymore. However, I do worry about this game with the media. It's naughty but nice with Rob. I love dishing about celebrities, which is why I am now doing it every day, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, on my new podcast, Naughty But Nice with Rob. Please check me out.